Hey, it's Brett Friedman from Vanity Mark Cosmetics, and I'm here with Eden Cher. And you might know her as Sue Hecht on the middle. So I love that you're not an awkward teen. No, I'm not. Thanks in part to you. <laughs> People make up skills. <laughs> well, you know, it wasn't hard. You're gorgeous, and I love that you look crazy plain on the show. Yeah, it's definitely a change. It's so nice to be able to play like a total geek on TV so that I can glam up and dress up when I have like real photo shoots. So and like, be me. Exactly. Yeah. Show the real Eden. Yeah. So I thought I was going to show a lash tip today on how to use short individual eyelashes to give like an almond shaped eye and a little drama. I think we should do that. Okay, that cool. perfect. I love lashes. I love, if I had to give up any part of makeup, I can give up everything except the lashes. The lashes. And lashes yeah. are great because it doesn't read as makeup. Exactly. So. Exactly. That's why they're so wonderful. Yes. So, okay. So come along. We'll uh, transform uh, Miss Eden's lashes. That's good. So the three things you're going to need are the Dura Lash by Ardell, and it's short black individuals. So look at that. Duo Lash Adhesive in Dark Tone. This stuff's the best. And then a pair of tweezers. So let's do before and after. So we did one. I mean, Eden already has amazing lashes, but look straight down. I just added five or six to the ends, and I'm going to show you how to integrate into your lash line. The first thing you're going to do is apply your mascara and curl your lashes. Do everything as usual. You will put the lashes on after. Now, I don't start at the very end. I start just in from the corner. Put a little dot of glue and then kind of work your way out and you want to put the last lash where the lash naturally ends. So if you put one a little too far, you might get that like hung dog look, <laughs> that sort of droopy corner eye. Now as you go in, you just want to integrate and then the lashes get shorter as they go in. So I do about halfway over. Look up in the mirror and you can see like where there are holes. Look down. So you can actually go and put a few more on the very end. I like to make the lashes thicker on the very end just because it gives that little extra you know, whoosh, that little extra lift. He knows what he's doing. <laughs> now how does that feel? Weightless, right? I, I literally did not even feel you putting them on. It's different than a strip lash. Okay, yeah. so then what I like to do is let them dry for a second and then right at the, you know, just another coat of mascara. This is L'Oreal Voluminous Carbon, which is, I really like. I love the fat brush. And really get each lash. And this kind of marries it to your natural lash. This kind of brings them all together. And then it's literally impossible to see. Now one came off, see that? <laughs> so we're gonna reapply. It happens. So we're going to take jumper. another one. It's a jumper, exactly. <laughs> and we're going to put it right back where it was. Let's see. And then a little glue going on there. Let's see. It's like a problem child. And then look straight up. Then it's fabulous lashes. You can't really tell when you do these little individuals. Now in the daytime, if you're going to do a more natural look, you can get brown short flares. Now I always curl afterwards right at the root, just for a second. Now, the, uh, the, the, the individuals will curl differently than your natural lash. They take the curl really fast. So just do a tight, tight, really short bump. Look straight up. And then a little extra on the bottom. And then what we're going to do now is I'm going to smoke out Eden's eyes, and we'll show you at the photo shoot what it looks like. Are you excited? I'm so excited. <laughs> you can't see it, but it looks amazing. I trust you. <laughs> <laughs> All right, so here we go. Give me a little attitude. Yeah. Oh my god, gorgeous. That looks amazing. Nice. 